Happy birthday to me! Mm. It's a game I can't find a man in money. I'm not gonna find one in Oxford. <laughs> She got spiked last night. I just keep thinking about it and it was fucking so scary. I just want to go to the bloody cost drive through Delhi and I don't know where we eat. <laughs> Look how cute that is. Ah! I've got no idea. What the hell day is it? No idea. Saturday, maybe, maybe 24? No, definitely not. I've got no idea. I'm going out tonight. I'm going out with one of my friends to start with, and I think the other one of my friends is coming later. We're actually going to be at one because they've given me a £50 bar tab to spend, which I think is a bit of an early birthday present, if I'm honest. Like, they absolutely love me in there. I'm thinking about getting a job because they literally love me so much, um, and I love them so much. Like, I'm actually excited to go and see them. Is that sad? Is it, I'm excited. <laughs> I'm excited to go to the bar to see the bartenders. Not that, like, I fancy or anything, because I really. I really don't, but they're just the nicest people ever. Like, they're just so sweet. Like, they just come, they just come and sit on our table, and I just, I just love it. Anyway, I'm actually really excited. Like, my birthday basically starts now, and I know that it's more than a week before my actual birthday, but I'm pretending that my birthday starts now. I've been listening to some cheese in the shower, and it's literally got me so pumped, and I just can't wait. Now, I'm actually kind of worried about the length of this vlog, to be honest with you. It might be like an hour long, but to be honest, you only have one 21st birthday, so I'm literally not sorry. I need to just tell you about it. We're going to tell you right now, because I'm not going to do, like, get ready with me through this whole thing, because otherwise, there'll be like loads of get ready with me because I'm doing so much for my birthday this year. I just need to talk you through my new eyebrow routine guys. I have mastered the skill of my own eyebrows and I think that's actually quite hard. Like I've tried so many different things over the years and oh my god, actually <laughs> to be fair, it'd be quite a funny thing to do right now whilst it's like my little birthday vlog. I'm going to do a little evolution of my eyebrows here so enjoy this because this is the journey that my eyebrows have been on over the last however long since I've been doing makeup and my god, it's a journey. But I've mastered it. So basically I just use the Got To Be Glued which is to Shauna. She, um, she actually bought this. But I think it's literally only like five pounds six pounds or something like that so it's actually so affordable and there's so much in there like i swear to god by the end of our tenancy we won't be out of this stuff but so i literally get that and then i use a what are they called spoolie spoolies look at me have you over here and just like brush them up like that this is not a makeup tutorial i'm not going to go on for a bad of ages but i'm really happy that by my 21st birthday i've mastered the art of my own eyebrows so I literally just brush them up like that and now on a usual day i'll just leave them like that like hello bushy eyebrows didn't know i had you here under one minute eyebrow tutorial guys just jump on the trend. It won't be long, guys, before I'm on, like, you know, that Vogue, like, how I do my makeup thing. You know that thing that, like, Madison Beer and, like, um, Kylie Jenner and stuff do? Dream big, guys, dream big. Right, so I'm aware that, like, I'm from a horror movie right now, but can we just... Can we just appreciate? <laughs> about this lip gloss hello beauty influencer this is from maybelline it is the maybelline lifter gloss it is so nice doesn't it look like the fenty beauty ones absolutely obsessed and let me just put it on because oh my god it's wow and it's basically like a plumper and a lip gloss mm. it feels so velvety putting on as well i, just, I love it mm, mm, mm. for anyone that is wondering this is in the shade amber number seven love it <laughs> Good morning guys. Yeah, I slept with my earrings in last night. Also, my camera really needs charging. Um, but good morning. I had a great night last night. I actually stopped drinking at like, I think I stopped drinking at like midnight or something like that because I wanted to feel okay today. And I do feel okay today actually. I went, I didn't end up getting sleep till like six o'clock though. Like, I don't even know why. Like, I got home at like three and I really wanted a pizza, right? And it took, I'm not kidding, like, I went and just was speaking to the concierge man because he was literally so nice actually. It was a new concierge man and he was literally just like the nicest guy ever. So I went and speaking with, th with him and like trying to get a pizza and I didn't get the pizza until about half past five in the end. Actually a bit later than that. It was like quarter to six. I literally like munched it and then went to bed. Right, my camera died. Put it on charge. Had a little cry to a video on Instagram. <laughs> No, standard, sad. But well, I can't even remember what I was saying now. I met this really, really nice guy in the concierge as well and we literally just stood and chatted for like for like two hours. It was really nice. He'd just, just done a night shift or something like that. So me and him and the concierge guy just stood and had a chat about all sorts of stuff in life. Just had a long old chat, which was really, really nice. But I am quite tired today, but that's okay because I'm going to have a coffee. 
here it is. It's probably then another one. And go out with my parents. And I'm literally so excited to see my parents today. So this is basically like the day that we're kind of like celebrating my birthday. Um, because obviously I'm so busy next week. So they've come up for Sunday and I think they're here tomorrow. But I'm working tomorrow so I probably won't see them tomorrow. And we're going to go to the Ivy which is so nice. I've never been to the Ivy before. Um, and I'm actually really, really excited to go. See what the hype is all about. Um, we'll probably go to a couple of other little places afterwards for a couple of drinks. Um, ow. Jesus. I had to wake up extra early today because I had to get my video edited and saved and stuff. The grind, guys. Honestly, I went to bed at 6 and I woke up at 9 so that I was able to get this video up for you guys. So please appreciate it. I hope you enjoyed that video. I don't know when this video is going to... When is this video going to be going out? Oh my god, this video is probably not going to be out for literally like two weeks from now. I'm going to drink this coffee, have some cereal and then get ready. I can't wait. I can't wait to show my outfit as well. I've got a really, really nice outfit. Although my nails really don't go with it. Did I show you my nails? I really kind of don't really like them, but it's fine. It's fine. Mmm needs to be consumed ASAP. I look worse than I feel, trust me. I feel like I look dead. I'm actually really so happy with my mate. That did not make sense. That sentence didn't come out right. I'm ready. I'm actually so happy with how my makeup has turned out. I just done it kind of quite natural, which I quite like. Um, and I've got my hair just, I don't know if you, excuse the mess, honestly. I've got my hair just in this little like bun thing. And I'll show you my dress in a minute. I don't know what accessories to wear. I'm either gonna go, I'll show you and I'll show you the options. Cause I can't quite, I just can't pick which one to do. And I really need to leave in a sec because the booking is at one and if you're late then they literally give it away. So this is the outfit. So I've just got this dress on that I got from New Look actually and I'm actually obsessed with it. Like I love it so much. I can't decide though whether to do orange heels or keep it white heels. I don't know. I don't really think I'm, do I like it with the orange? I don't know. I feel like maybe I should just go white. Let me put the white ones on and then I, then I can make a decision. Not that you guys are actually going to be able to tell me which one to wear, but sorry, how gorgeous is this dress? I'm obsessed. This is the other option. So it's literally just like the white heels and back. I think I'm going to go with the white heels. I feel like I don't really want a pop of colour today and these ones are really, really easy to walk in. So this is the outfit. I'm excited to go see my parents. I'm excited to just like, I don't know, celebrate my birthday. It's exciting. Really exciting. I will take you with me. I don't know how much I'm going to film because I don't know how much they're going to want to be on camera, but I will try and film a couple of bits in the IV just because why not? Happy birthday to me. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. We're on our way up to the toilet. Also, can't show you below here because it's my present that I'll show you in another video, guys. Oh, geez. just wait for that. Right, so I'm home now, finally. I literally had the best day ever. Like, honestly, one of the best days I've had in a very long time. I literally love my parents so much. And I actually got to get a little bit emotional earlier when I left them because I just, I literally just love them so much. They're the most amazing people ever. They care about me so much and it's just like, it's, it's just amazing. It's just amazing. They're both the most amazing people ever and we're so, so lucky, me, Jordan and Ben, to have them in our lives. But I'm back home now. I'm going to just have some food and go to bed because I'm bloody knackered. Um, and I don't know where I'm going to pick this vlog up next. Probably next weekend when we get back on the birthday. Cheers. I just, I've had the best day. I've had the best day. I can't wait to show you what they got me as well. Hello, guys. Good morning. So... I'm coming to you from a very, very different location today. This is my family home. I'm back home. Um, I was actually going to vlog this morning when I woke up. I mean, it is still the morning, I think. Yeah, it's like 11. Um, but my car battery was out of charge. Um, and my camera was in my car. So I literally couldn't find it for a minute. And I was stressing the hell out. Because I was like, where the hell have I put my camera? And then the battery was dead. If you can't tell, I've just been on a run. I did like 6.5k, which actually felt really, really good. Like, I feel like I'm getting a lot fitter. I'm not necessarily doing lots of running. But because I'm walking so much at work, I feel like it's just making me a lot fitter. Anyway, I'm back home now. I drove back home last night. Oh my god, should we talk about the drive for a second? So I left 
left at about nine o'clock. I went and got some snacks from co-op after work. I finished work up as day. I went and got some snacks from co-op. Got in my car, started driving at about nine o'clock. I was on the road by nine, right? I didn't get home until half past one. I know, I literally didn't get home until half past one. There was so much traffic on the M6. I think everybody's just like going on holiday or like going away for bank holiday or whatever. But there was loads of road works. And obviously because it was the middle of the night, they were doing all the road work. So yeah, it was an absolute nightmare getting home. But it was fine. I just sat, listened to some JB, listened to some tunes, some Rihanna, of course, and just got home. But I've woken up this morning, I had a coffee. I tried, I used this coffee machine. I don't know if you can see. Honestly, the most confusing thing ever. I definitely did it wrong, but it still tasted like coffee and gave me a coffee buzz, so that's fine. Um, I then went for a run. I've already told you that, haven't I? I definitely have already told you. Anyway, I'm back now. It's 11 o'clock. I'm going to get in the shower, and then I'm going to go and get my hair done with Tilly. I'm super, super excited. Look at that. Thing is, I don't actually know what I want, and I need to talk to her about it, like, <laughs> because I don't actually know what I want. I don't know whether I want literally, like, blonde or root drag and blonde at the front i really don't know what i want and i can't decide like i'm quite liking like the, the dark roots but then i look back on photos of me with blonde hair and i'm like oh i do like that and then sometimes i'll make oh i don't and i just can't decide so i feel like i'm not going to decide until i'm sat in the chair until he tells me what's up excited to see her as well i haven't seen her obviously in ages um so that'd be nice to see her and then we'll just see what we're going to do later probably not much until i have to get ready to go out tonight i've got a couple of friends coming over and then we're going to go out in oxford which is so nice my parents are probably going to do a little thing because they can't help themselves which is really really cute um also i'll show you my new um my new house for anyone that's been in my house which is such a small percentage of you so i don't know why i'm saying it like that but we've had like our living room redone so you're now coming from the kitchen and there's now carpet here which is kind of cute and then they've just got this little sofa because there's only the two of them here most of the time which is kind of cute um yeah but that's basically it. i mean it's not that interesting we've just got a new carpet we used to all be wood like that and now we've just got a new carpet which is really really cute i feel like when you live here all the time, like when you're younger, you don't appreciate your family home. And then when you come back from living in a small flat, you really appreciate it. <laughs> Does anyone else feel that? Does anyone else feel that? If they've lived, moved to the city, and obviously ev everywhere in the city is just going to be tiny. Um, and then you come back to your family home, like in the countryside, and you're like, oh, like, <laughs> I live in such a small space. I love it here, and I'm so happy to be back. But not for long. Right, anyway, I'm getting in the shower. I've literally, bl I, can't, I can't stop talking. I can't stop talking. So let's get in the shower. I'm ready. I'm late. Are we shocked? No. Ooh, I've got all my stuff, put a tiny little bit of makeup on, and oh my god, I'm trying to get my phone in my bag and I just can't do it. I need to go and meet Tilly. I don't want to be late for her because that's just that's just not fair, is it? I got paid um cash in hand the other day, so I'll use that. I'll use that to pay her. Chaotic! I was actually ready like half an hour ago. And then of course I tried to film some TikToks, so that's why I'm late. Are we shocked? No, again, it's my little OOTD. I just got this again, green tracksuit. I'm gonna wear this to death, can't help it. This little naked fashion top underneath, I mean, it's literally just a basic white top. My bag and my super dry shoes, cute. Let's go. <laughs> I've gone for not fully blonde, actually, because I just, I don't wanna kill my hair. So we've gone for, you can speak. <laughs> you can carry on. <laughs> so I've gone for like, just kind of the front bits. Um, and then just like, I don't know. She knows what she's doing, to be honest. I feel like it's better because it won't kill my hair and it'll still look blonde, but I kind of like the dark roots a little bit. Like, I kind of, that's my natural colour. Like, surely your hair's a natural colour for, for a reason. We have kept a bit of a brown, put blonde through the front. A little bit like Sophia Tuxford vibes. That's kind of what I've gone for. I'm not saying I'm going to look anything like her because I really won't. I haven't seen blonde hair like that around my face in a while. You know when you wake up and, like, you look in the mirror and you're like, fucking hell, I look rough. It's like the blonde just, that just sorts that out. Yeah, it does all the time. I love getting my hair washed. I wish I could get you to get my hair washed every day. Do you do like wash and blow dries? Yeah. How much do you charge for that? It depends on the hair and things. Yeah. Like, it'll be like 15, 20, but it depends if it, you've got shit a lot of hair. Yeah. It's like 20 quid, it's 15. That's not even that bad though, to be fair. The last time I was in these videos, it's <laughs> done me dirty. <laughs> That was ages ago. Helena now. was even videoing. Was it Helena videoing me? Yeah, it was Helena. Yeah. <laughs> Can we appreciate my eyebrows as well? By the way. Yeah, they're, they're actually actually unreal, good. aren't they? They do actually look very good. I've no, you haven't any of them. No, just use the got to be glued stuff. Oh. It's great. Mm. Right, I'm back home. Her has been done. Look at it. Oh my god, it looks so 
blonde so thank you so much tilly for that i'm so so grateful she did a little chop at the end as well I'm trying to keep it really long i really want to grow my hair out but i feel like i look so different also look at that but i mean what can you do like when you get your hair washed that's gonna happen it's five o'clock my parents are gonna be home from work just after half five luckily my hair's done thanks to till so i literally just need to do my makeup i'm gonna take this makeup off and just restart it i don't actually have any foundation on or anything or maybe i'll actually leave my eyebrows on and i'll just wipe around it because i can't be asked to do my eyebrows again because they take a hot minute but i'm actually gonna eat some some food quick so what i've got to eat is some hummus are we shocked? I literally could eat hummus every single day of my life. I haven't actually had anything to eat yet today and it is five o'clock. That's not great. Oh no, I had a couple of crisps. That's not great. And then I'm gonna just have them with these little Ribita pins. I love these. Oh my God, these are literally so good. These and hummus, like, oh, I'll, I could eat the whole pack. In fact, I definitely have done that before. Super excited to get ready. I'm super excited for everybody to come around, have a little birthday celebration. I'm sure my parents will go above and beyond as always because what's new? Oh, I really need to charge my phone as well because it's on 5%. That's good. That's really going to get me through the night. Right, I'm going to go. Already, this is the app. Oh my god, stop. My bed is a mess. This is a little outfit. I'll show you it properly in a bit. Uh, I don't know whether to keep this necklace on or not. I feel like it looks a bit weird, but then I think it looks weird without it too. I don't know. It looks a bit plain without it. Like, I kind of want it on. I think I might just leave it on. Like, who cares? I'm excited for my friends to come and go out and have a drink. I haven't had a drink in a while, so I'm excited to do that. Give up on my way. Find a man in money, I'm not gonna find one in Oxford, let's be real. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it feels good to be back in Oxford. It feels nice to walk down the streets, you know. Like, you know, when it's so it feels so well known, but also being here when I was younger, I remember when we used to get off the bus and we used to think this place was huge. Yeah, and now I'm walking here, I'm like, everything's so tiny. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, well, but it's nice to be. Oh yeah, we do oh, both. We have. We'll um. We'll wait. We'll wait. We'll wait. First of all, I look like a freaking state, so yeah, we're not even gonna talk about it. I'm actually using my new little car tripod thing right now, but I don't actually know if it's actually like good. Like, I, 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 no idea. So, obviously, like the last couple of clips that you saw were like, so I look really, really bad, but hopefully, this will explain why. Um, last couple of clips you saw, I was having a great time. I literally, like, you know, it was, I was literally just having the best time last night. It's so nice to see everybody from home, I haven't seen them in ages, and Everyone was just getting on, everyone's having a great time. Um, the drinks were flowing, as we do say. Um, yeah, it was really good fun. We got up and had a little dance. I'm sure the clip shows some of that. I don't really know what I got on camera, to be honest with you. Um, however, at about, I have no idea what time it was. Maybe, maybe like midnight. Um, I actually got spiked last night. It was probably one of the scariest experiences I've had 
like on nights out so different to just being really drunk i think a lot of the time people could just think like oh she's just really drunk because she just had too much to drink guys it is not like that it is so different i could not move a muscle or bone in my body i literally was stuck like or it felt like it. it felt like i was like weighed down by like metal like the most horrible feeling and it was almost like i was aware of where i was kind of for some of it i don't know i feel like maybe i blacked out for a bit but when i came back around i was aware of where i was like i knew where i was and who i was with and who i was and all that stuff but i couldn't do anything and i knew what had happened and that was terrifying because i'm then still in this bar with someone who has done this to me like it was literally just horrible guys it was oh my god and like i i feel like i'm just not really getting it across very well at all it was the most horrible experience i've ever had on a night out and it's such a shame because i was having literally such a great night like we were all having so much fun like it was so nice to see everybody so happy and like just really enjoying themselves like I, and it was like nice it's like i've got all these people together that i care about a lot and then that happened and it ruined everybody's night someone ruined my night and all the people i was with we were all terrified and scared and sad and just like gutted that it happened um so yeah that happened last night but i'm not gonna let it ruin my birthday like trust it to be on my birthday weekend as well like i just wanted to enjoy my birthday um yeah but that happened and i'm over it now i'm fine i feel good i'm on the way back to money where i'm safe <laughs> apparently i literally can't believe i've been living in manchester for three months nothing's happened to me and then i come home back to oxford for one night and that happens so that's really great uh <laughs> It's just typical, isn't it, really? So I just want to say on this vlog for you guys that I'm sure are watching, thank you so much to all my friends last night for just being the best support ever. I mean, you're all amazing, but Lozzie and Christy in particular, I don't think Lozzie stopped koalaing me from the moment that it happened until I was in my mum's arms back at home. Um, yeah, I just want to say a massive thank you to you guys because... If it wasn't for you, then I have no idea what could have happened or where I could have been. Like, I was so lucky for it to be just what it was. And I fully put it down to you guys. So thank you. <laughs> thank you so much. And I'm going to get emotional because seriously, it was scary. <laughs> and I think about it, like, I just keep thinking about it and it was fucking so scary. But you guys really made it a lot easier. Right. I'm going to stop crying and I'm going to get back to Manchester, play a couple of tunes in the car, get me ready for tonight because I'm actually so excited tonight. Although I feel like ETA says quarter past six and people are supposed to be coming around at seven. So we might have to make that time half past seven. Um, <laughs> great. I'm definitely going to be late. No, it's fine. I'm just hoping I don't have to stop. I've got a couple of little snacks. Only three hours. It's not that bad. Let's just get there and have a great time and forget about last night. Stay safe out there, guys. Seriously, just please stay safe. Look after your drinks. Don't put them down on a table. You know, get drinks from a random guy in the club if you want, but go up to the bar and get it for yourself with him. Don't let him bring you on. Like, you know, it's easy to do that kind of stuff when you're when you're really drunk. Like, just be like, yeah, yeah, I'll have a drink and just like take a drink off someone. It's really easy to do that. Um, just don't just don't if someone offers you a drink say yeah cool let's go up to the bar and get it and take it from the bartender do not take it from their hand like just don't it's just really not worth it it's not worth the free drinks it's just not <laughs> trust me um yeah that's enough of me ranting i don't want to make this such like a negative vlog i want it to be a happy vlog um, i just wanted to pop this in here just to explain one reason why i look like this and two just to make you guys aware of what has happened I'm not gonna blab about it for much longer I, I, i'd say that i would have been blabbing for eight minutes i'm definitely gonna cut most of this out right let's go let's put some tunes on and let's just get gone Because I don't 
Salim. Hey y'all. How are you? I'm good. How are you? Yeah, I'm good. I'm on the way back now. Sean I'm in love. Really? What happened? Um that's why the sun is out guys because it's getting a bit warm. Where the hell am I going? I just want to go to the bloody cost drive through Delhi. I don't know where it is. Oh, it's over there. It does I do feel like I'm gonna fall asleep at wheel, so I am getting cost drive through. Oops. How the hell am I gonna get in there from this direction? Weird. I'm gonna quickly stop, get a costa. Do I get something to eat? Mm, no, Ella, you don't need anything to eat. Um, I did start eating the sandwich. Oh shit, I just dropped it everywhere. I started eating the sandwich, um, I know it's making me feel a bit sick. We could just get like a kilo, kilo summer something. Hi, can I have a iced vanilla latte with oat milk, please? Yeah, is that a medium size? Uh, yeah, please. Anything else? Um, can I also get a banana loaf cake, please? Uh, let me just double check we got that. All oh, right, thank you. Caved in. I got a banana loaf. What can I say? Hi, thank you. Thank you. Thanks, have a nice day, bye-bye. Mm. Mm. Jesus, they've got a lot of vanilla in that. There's a lot of vanilla in that set. Oh. Here we are. Right, I've got half an hour left on my journey. I just want to be there now. I just literally want to... No, not half an hour, sorry, a whole hour. One whole hour left. And I just want to be home now. Mm. Cheers to the freaking weekend. Drank to that. Yeah, yeah. Right, I'm going. Guys, I've just walked into my flat. Look what Sean's done. Look. <laughs> Look how cute that is. Oh, I'm obsessed. I'm actually obsessed. Look, and I got some presents. How exciting. I'm so excited. <laughs> what should we do then? Want me to open them now? Yeah, I'll open them now. <laughs> okay. Then we need to get ready. You don't know how you're, the hell you're going to come out tonight. Sean is I not know. feeling great. I was like lying there thinking, oh God, I don't know, but like it's your birthday, so I have to. How cool is this balloon as well? So you can like see your Yeah, I there. love that. Oh, an illusion, right. Let's open the presents. We go again, guys. We go again. Let's turn the music on. Um, you can't let it get you down. Do you know what I mean? You just got to get up and go again. Change the memories. That's the way to do it. Change it from a bad memory to a good memory by just doing it again. Yeah. 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 Outfit time. Let me show you. Oh, okay. So this dress is from Pretty Little Thing. Actually, we're both. We're all Pretty Little Thing today. Are your shoes ego? Uh, my shoes are from Ego and my bag is from Prime. Hair. Beautiful little dress. We're very colourful today. And then my heels are, I have got you no idea. Uh, maybe Boohoo a while ago. We've just popped the van. My mum bought me this when we actually moved into our flat. So we've had it for three months sat in the fridge. And we're finally having it tonight on Ella's 21st. Cheers to 21. Oh, quite strong, that isn't it? Yeah. Pan of juice. Yeah. Oh my god, you got it on me. What? Oh, look at that. Look at this. Oh, oh, you can't get this. Oh, we're off to guesswork. Be it one. Of course, we are. Oh, of course, we are. It's my yeah, yeah. Ding, 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 ding. Damn. Yeah, we're going to bit one. Sorry, can we just appreciate my eyebrows, please? <laughs> They're stunning. No, They're hold stunning. on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Zoom off. Oh, no, we can't. We wait. Oh. oh. And then we're going to go to China White later. I don't know how much we're going to film because realistically, I'll probably forget to get my camera no, out. Like, I'll be shocked. Last night, I got my camera out and and it didn't, it wasn't good. So <laughs> maybe I won't get my camera out tonight. I don't know what to say. Guys, we've crumbled. Okay, it's like what two a.m. nearly. We've got we've got a Pizza Hut delivery, garlic bread, and what's this gonna be? Oh, we might have to get a fork. Garlic bread, mac and cheese, and a pizza. Guys, wow. We went to China White. Wasn't good, really at all. Here we are back at home. I've got to get up in like eight hours for Greenfield. 
Oh, mm. 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 mm -mm. Little table. I never actually understand what these are for, though. Like to keep the pizza together. Yeah, but it's only got three spikes, and there's one, two, three lots yeah, of no. like I slices. Oh, it could be for. I don't know what it's for, really. Anyone, if anybody knows what this little triangle thing is for, let me know. Should we cheer? No. Okay, I was gonna cheers pizza with you, but Ooh. cheers. No, we don't have pizza hut in Ireland. Really? We used to, but now I'll close down. Oh. Good morning. It's my birthday. It's actually my birthday today. Um, wow, I look a mess in that spot as well. I really wanted that to come up on my birthday. Great. So, oh dear, it's really not a good situation over here, is it, Ellen? I'm so glad I actually went home at a decent time yesterday. Now I don't feel too bad. I'm tired. Hang on, I'm bloody tired. I'm so tired. But I'm going to Creamfields today. I <laughs> literally am so excited. Um, so it's currently 20 to 9. Um, I'm not quite sure what time Benji's picking me up. Uh, my friend Benji's taking me. Bless him. Um, <laughs> I literally just roped him into it and I feel really bad, but... Pfft. I need a need a way there. I'm giving him 20 quid. I'm giving him 20 quid. I'm buying him a coffee. I'm not quite sure what time we're leaving. I think he said something like half nine. Um, but at the end of the day, I can just make him wait, realistically. Like, he's just going to have to wait. Um, I need to go... going to do my makeup as well. But then I do need to go to Boots to get some lashes. And I'll just stick them on in the car. Um, but we're going to, like, literally, like, the retail park over there that's got a Boots. And then it's also got a Costa. And I'm going to buy him a coffee on myself. Yeah. Guys, I've made it to 21. What can I say? Do I look older? Let's get ready. Ready, I'll show you my outfit in just a sec. You guys have seen it if you've seen the video. I'm not taking my camera with me because this wee little bag is not gonna fit it in. Um, I'm so excited. I'm just so excited to see everybody as well, but I'll quickly show you my outfit. Dignity is a, a, a low right now, but whatever. Here it is. Here's the fit. Creamfield 2021, baby. Bye, I'll catch up with you tomorrow. I am well and truly dead. It is, oh my god, I've got that. Oh, I've got that tinnitus thing in your ear. Do you ever get that? Um, what? I did not ask for this, what? Okay, well and truly dead. It is like four o'clock in the afternoon and I've literally just got up, like I literally have just slept all day. But that's okay, I'm now doing a little tidy of the house, I need to eat something as well. My voice is absolutely F-U-T-K-E-D. But I just need to chill, I need to chill. Also my skin, I don't even know what's happened. I think it's just like the whole drinking a lot and being unhealthy, my skin has just really not, not enjoyed it at all, to be honest with you. I'm dead, I sound dead. I'll catch up with you tomorrow. Okay, guys, I am back down in my family home again, and I'm actually just going to end this vlog here. It's come to a pretty abrupt end, but wow, what a massive weekend. Two weeks, just like crazy, crazy, crazy stuff. I had the best birthday ever. Can't believe I'm 21. Can't believe I finally got there. Kind of feels like I've cheated a year with the whole COVID thing, but yeah, we've made it. 21. I hope you really, really enjoyed this vlog, guys. Um, it's been really fun editing it back. Some really, really great memories. Some really sad memories. Some things I won't ever forget. But some really, really good memories with some great, great people. So, yeah. Thank you so much for watching. If you're not subscribed, please go down and subscribe. I'm really nearly at 2K. So, please go and hit that subscribe button. Give this video a like if you'd enjoyed. And I will see you next week with another video. Bye.